Hey, what's going on guys? Nick and I here today with the Clash Army and I'm checking in on my beginner Clash of Clans account and I'm going to announce that I'm going to be doing more of this account on my main channel in the form of, you know, strategies, base builds, and lower level gameplay because there are a ton of people doing high level gameplay so I thought I would bring this account back to my main account channel in the near future just so you guys know my main channel is teach boom beach and you can type that at youtube.com slash teach boom beach now today i'm kind of tired so i'll kind of try to keep this video a little bit shorter than normal just because i went to the iphone 6 plus launch where i got this bad boy right here that's the iphone 6 plus that's the back of it right there this is what i'm playing on right now an ipad mini and you guys can go ahead and take a look at that right there. So I'm playing on my iPad mini. I just got the 6 Plus. I love it. I got to set it up. But I woke up at 3.30 in the morning to go get that thing. So let's go ahead and do some gameplay here. Check in on my base that I haven't been to in a while. And then we'll keep going from there. The Hype Man and That Air Clash of Clans live trailers are now out. You can find those on the in-game menu on my channel and on Clash of Clans official channel. So we're going to start clearing some mushrooms. And see what to do with this base that has not been checked in on this poor base in oh so long because of how many random things have been going on. So first things first, I think it's time to try out the new wall feature. How about you guys? So what I'm going to do is move a wall over here. I'm going to select a row. And we're going to select a whole row and upgrade. And upgrade. Sweet. So that was my first time doing that, and to be honest, that works really well. It's super easy. It's easier than going like this, even though if you're just going a, a couple of them, you could always go the quote-unquote old-fashioned way. But this is how I would do it right here. Boom. So we've got most of our wall walls gold. We've got a few of them level 4. But I think we should start off first here with an attack. And then we'll go ahead and come back and analyze the base a little bit more and see what we should upgrade. Man, these are the kind of bases I'm getting matched up against. Let me just quickly face roll across the screen here, just closing my eyes and just dropping whatever I'm dropping right here. Hopefully it's not the lightning spell. Okay, I didn't drop the lightning spell. Alright, couple archers on the back side here. We're just going to go for cups. I got to boost this uh, account up a little bit. Oh, I didn't see this stuff down here. Uh, legit placement, bruh. Alright, let's see what we got going on. Let's drop a lightning spell right there on that archer tower. Boom! Zap her down. And damage the cannons. We're going for that loot now. I don't have anything in the clan castle, I don't believe. So we're going to have to just deal with this mortar here. Very, very spread out base. I didn't even look in that corner either. What a joke of a base. This guy probably quit. Oh, uh, his stuff's boosted, so he seems like he's got... This is the strategy, you guys. The cannons over here... I don't know if I told you, but this is the new strategy. You put all your gold in one corner and just surround it with defenses. All right, here we go. Um, one archer tower, one cannon left, and unfortunately, they're laying into my guys because they're focusing on what really matters, which is that loot, that loot, that loot. Luckily, there's nothing splash damage or this raid would already be over, but the archers are going to finish up on these gold storages and I believe turn around right here. A couple of them decide to turn around, and they start going for the archer. And boom, level 1 archer tower versus level 3 archers, I want to say. Alright, here we go. Archers laying into the cannon. Down it goes, and just a couple more buildings here. There's the 16-hour shield. Um, we're going to wait, because this will affect my trophies, which is partially what I'm pushing for here. And the barbs and archers come running in, and they're going to take down that army camp, right? Boom! They're going to take down this laboratory, and boom! Color looks great on the screen right now. I'm just watching me play on my computer, not on my iPad right now. Let's see here. I'm actually going to boost up. This is the new iOS 8. Let's boost up the, the brightness. Wait. You tripping? Whoa, it like goes up and then it goes back down. All right, whatever. We'll leave it right here. It looks good to me. Let's see. We are now in a league again. Thank goodness. Let's go clear two trunks and decide what should we put our first builder on. Well, I don't have too much gold. Arch tower can go to five. And let's max out this town hall six. So can I do, I can't do my golds yet. I could do this one up here. That one's only level four. I have to wait a couple seconds though. 727. I'm waiting for 1000 to get the next builder. How are we going to get there? Well, gold storages, um, town hall at 8 will give us some. 500 obstacles. We're pretty close to that one. Let me start this gold mine right here. And in my barracks, I've got archers that are, yeah, level 3, just like I said. Good guess, good guess. 
I've got barbs, I've got goblins, and we're going to build some more lightning spells. So that's what's going on there. Uh, the clan that I'm in right now, oops, don't want to request again, is called Teach Boom Beach. It's a level 80 and up, I believe. Uh, King24412 and Teach Boom Beach, we are the, uh, the overwatchers of this clan here. I'm definitely slacking a little bit, but... This clan they mostly just do to check in on and like, you know, check on lower level updates like upgrading the walls. That's kind of hard to do on my upper level account where they cost a million each. Down here they don't cost too much each, so it's more doable. Excuse me, a little burp going on there. Alright. Clear some mushrooms. We're going to spend a couple gems on these troops here. And then after that we'll be done with the gemming for the episode. And we will uh, go ahead and throw all of our guys on some upgrades. Oh man. Boom, right there. Now I'll fill it back up with archers. And all archers works for me. The, ba the bases down here really aren't going to be much. But let's see what we get matched up against here. I'm just looking at the gold count right when I load this up. And if it's not worth it, 15k. Doesn't really seem worth it. What do we got? 120 gold? Really? All of that gold is available for me to take? Um, let's see what else we got. 7,000. We're in that kind of no man's land where you're not going to find much. 3,000. All right, next three searches, I'm picking one. 500. If it beats 500, I'll beat it. 9,000. Tunnel 9. Right, get out of here, dude. Oh, no. Reload the game. Out of sync. Huh. Haven't had that in a while. Let's just attack one of these first couple bases here. So on this base here, how would you attack it? Hmm, kind of actually good. He put boxes around all his defenses. So what we're going to do here is just layer some archers because the mortar cannot hit us on this side over here. And now we're going to distract this mortar with some goblins. Then bring in some barbs. Then layer in the archers. And that should do it right there for that base. So over here on the other side, we're just going to layer in archers. And the mortar's still like, I got to get all those goblins. But the mortar's about to get destroyed by archers when that was the real only threat in this entire base when you look at it. So a simple barch plus goblin raid here wipes the base out with only level, uh, what is that, two stone wall. Let's see, level one, two, and three wall all right next to each other. And the 100% is coming up, boom, right there. There it goes. So, those were two really, really easy raids. A check-in on a base that's been inactive for a little while, and a reboot. Let's go ahead and upgrade something. How about we upgrade our lightning spell? That sounds good to me. 200k, that normally takes a lot. Um, what else can we upgrade with gold? Um, nothing really seems feasible. Uh, I've got one builder, a decent amount of elixir. How about an army camp? There we go, that one's only level 1. So we're going to start upgrading some army camps. Those two are level 4, so that works out perfectly. I got all my builders going, got a couple successful raids, and we're back up and running. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Our whole crew will keep the videos coming. I'm going to get some rest because it's been one heck of a day with this iPhone and waking up at 3.30 in the morning. But I did want to check in on this base right before I did that. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you in the next episode, and I'm Nick at night.